This is an old revolution counter of the type that was normally used with steam engines. It has five digits, an axle going through the case, and each, each revolution of that axle will increment the counter. The case has a lock on the front to keep people from tampering with the digits. And uh, yeah, when it's unlocked you can hinge open the case. And here is the mechanism itself. It uses these uh, wheels for the carry mechanism. And those are exactly the kind of uh, carry mechanism wheels that are still being used today. Nevertheless, I think this is one of the first counters to use exactly this mechanism. The mechanism that's used to drive the unit wheel is quite interesting. It uses an, it uses an eccentric gear. This is exactly the same as is used in the tachometer calculator. The gear has uh, 9 teeth compared to the number wheels 10. So each time the gear moves around once, it pulls the number wheel by one tooth. The counter can be reset, and that's done by this hinged part here. If you hinge this up, it essentially removes a spacer from the axle and this allows the number wheels to, to be uh, moved out and changed. This machine has no markings on it anywhere. There's no maker's mark, no, no logo. So I have no idea who made it, but I have found a patent for a counter which is very, very similar to this. It differs only in that it doesn't use the eccentric gear. That patent is from 1879 and by Eduard Stahlmann. He was based in Bukau, which is a town right next to the city of Magdeburg. In Bukau there were several large industrial manufacturers such as Maschinenfabrik Bukau and Maschinenfabrik R. Wolf and they made steam engines. There's also the Schaefer and uh, Budenberg company and uh, yeah any one of those companies could have made this uh, this counter. And then again, maybe it was made somewhere else entirely. I really don't know, I have no way of confirming where this was made. Anyway, so this is an interesting old steam engine revolution counter, probably from the 1880s. Thank you for watching.